Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. So today um, it is a Wednesday, hump day. How are we all getting through the week? I'm getting there, I'm getting there. It helps tonight that I am off to the social for Aberdeen Restaurant Week. So all the bloggers that are participating, the ambassadors, we go along and have food and drinks together before the event starts. So. I don't know if you know much about Aberdeen Restaurant Week. If you're not from Aberdeen, then you definitely won't. But um, Aberdeen Restaurant Week is a, um, a restaurant event that happens. It's happened for maybe the past three years now, I think. And I've been lucky enough to um, take part all those years. So basically, I think it happens about twice a year as well. So for one week, restaurants in Aberdeen do discounted set menus so at lunchtime you can get menu a two course meal for 10 pounds and um, at dinner time you can get or evening sorry you can get um, a three course meal for 20 pounds what our job is is we go along to these restaurants and review the food to tell you like how great the menus are essentially so tonight is just a little bit of a social just to um, catch up with the bloggers and the Aberdeen inspired team who run Aberdeen Restaurant Week. Um, it's their initiative and yeah it'll be a good one. Um, I got sent my allocation for Aberdeen Restaurant Week today as well so I'm going to Cafe Harmony which is a little quaint Italian restaurant um, so that should be good. We're going there on Monday. Um, so yeah, I'll take you along then as well. But for now, we are away to do a street food tour, which um, is another one of the options that um, Aberdeen Restaurant Week are offering this time. It's new. Usually it's either the two or three meal courses. There has been afternoon teas. There's, there is afternoon teas this time as well. Um, there's cooking classes, but they've also got this new street food tour. So you can book yourself onto it. There's a couple of them starting maybe like six or different times depending on the day and um, i'll leave the link down below um so basically you're going around different places so we start off at the pig's wings which um you get to try their curry first then we go on to latin way for tacos i think i can't remember and one of the venezuelan drink and then we go to Tango Turtle, thanks Blair. Tango Turtle for something that I can't remember the name of. I'll leave it here. <laughs> yeah, but I've been to Tango Turtle before. I've vlogged about it and it was so good. Actually, no, I made a YouTube video as well. So yeah, I really like it there. So I'm excited to go there. Sorry, it's Caribbean food if I didn't mention that. And it's Mackey's ice cream for some dessert. And yeah, but a little extra for us is we're going to the Esselman after for some drinks just to celebrate and begin the week of great. So Aberdeen Restaurant Week is running from the 24th of December. I think it's till the 1st of March. I think that's the full week. 24th of December. Did I say December? The 24th of February to the 1st of March. Yeah, it's always a really good week. Lots of people get involved. Lots of restaurants are involved. Um, the menus are always really nice. Um, so yeah, definitely go and check that out if you are looking for something to do that week. Um, Try new menus at a discounted price, and then you'll then you'll know for next time that you like them and not spend loads of money. You know, it's great. So yeah, that's the plan. I am away to meet everyone else, and I'll take you around with me.
last leave you guys. So probably it would have been my Aberdeen Restaurant Week social. Um, so you'll have seen um, us going around all the places. My favourite place is probably Tango Turtle. I love the food in there. It's so lovely. Like the food in there is amazing. If you want to try Caribbean food, I'd highly recommend it. It's a good price as well, it's quite cheap. Um, another favourite would be Latin Way. That was definitely probably most bloggers' favourite. They loved it, the food is so fresh. It's a really good one. It is like Latin inspired, South American cuisine. They try and stay away from like burritos and all that sort of stuff, which is typically Mexican and they will have, I can't even name the things that they have, but they're really good. So that's another one you should try. Today we went to my actual restaurant for, for Aberdeen Restaurant Week. So me and Blair went to Cafe Harmony. Um, I've never been before and I didn't know what to expect. I've heard good things, but they've really downplayed their menu. I have to admit, I wasn't sure what to expect because I read the menu and I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm excited. But <gasps> the food was really good, wasn't it? Yeah, it was very, very good. The food was amazing. We started off with warm pita bread and it had like a sort of tomato -y sauce on it. As Blair said, it was kind of like pizza. It was so good. Um, dipped into hummus and it was like a garlicky hummus. Oh, it was so nice. And then we had some potato bravas as well, which was like, I think they're like homemade wedges with like a tomato -y, I don't even know. It was kind of like a tomato -y curry, curry kind of sauce. Do you, yeah? Yeah. It was amazing. It was so good. Not like any potatoes bravas I've had before the best patas bravas I've had before and this wasn't even like a past food you know this was a starter and it was so good for main course I had the vegetable tagine so it was like a bowl of like roast vegetables potatoes couscous and like a, t a rich tomatoey sort of sauce lovely so filling oh my god i'm so full up now but it was really really good uh both daughter and mains are were vegan which was even better uh blair went for a uh, carbonara obviously not vegan um it did have bits of bacon i think or ham in it i can't remember but it was so creamy i did have a i did have a little try it was very creamy um yeah it was spot on so that was lovely and then we had a masseuse to finish and it was just it was just a lovely night you know the service was really good as well there was a little bit of an incident a drunk guy um caused a little bit of a scene but the staff were so accommodating um they treated him well they got him out clay and they treated us all their uh customers to a glass of Prosecco on the house for the inconvenience um, which was really nice of them they didn't have to do that obviously we had a really good time honestly I could go out on Mondays more often start your week off good so yeah that was Aberdeen restaurant week and I hopefully will have this vlog edited in time probably not but we're gonna we're gonna hope I'll leave Aberdeen Restaurant Week website below and some of my reviews and stuff of past Aberdeen Restaurant Weeks and probably this at Aberdeen Restaurant Week and anything else. Go check it out. It's such a good week. Um, it starts from the 24th of February, so next Monday, a week today, and um, from when I'm filming. And yeah, it's two courses for a tenner or three courses for £20. And yeah, it's a winner. If you fancy trying somewhere new, but you don't want to fork out loads of money, Aberdeen Restaurant Week, it's the way to do it. That is um, my end to another Aberdeen Restaurant Week and it's, it's been a good one.